Oh, 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 oh. Almost. Oh, my gosh. oh no way. What? Almost five years. No way. What do you, what do you say? Oh, oh no! no! How do you do? Good to see you. Yes, I am. So, it finally happened. We met John and Martha King. Let's roll that intro. Hi, guys. My name is Esteban Monterroso, and I'm one of the co-owners of Avier. We are a fly school just outside of Boston. And recently, we had the amazing opportunity to fly out to San Diego and meet the Kings. For those of you that don't know, their courses, their online courses, have allowed millions of pilots to greatly improve their lives by learning how to fly. So in this vlog, we're gonna share this amazing experience with you guys. Our day began around 5 a.m. heading to Logan to catch our flight, which by the way, as I'm not a morning person, it was hell. To kick off this journey the right way, we flew JetBlue Men. We started off with some departure drinks, and after that, we had a delicious breakfast. I went with the poached egg, the rice, avocado toast, and the coconut yogurt. The drink, the mint condition, was my favorite throughout the flight. I highly recommend it. And once we were all fed, it was time to take a nap. I woke up to a personalized note from the crew, which were so kind and attentive throughout the flight. Angela and Gabriel, if you guys are watching this, thank you so much. You made all the difference. Okay. Right, guys. So here we are in San Diego. Yes, we are. I'm right. very happy to be here. What's like the uh, the part that you are most excited about? Seeing the John and Martha King. So we're gonna go to the hotel check in. We're gonna go to the hotel check in. Then we're gonna go check out uh, the Archer that we're here to see as well, and uh, lay, get the lay of the land, get a nice gourmet lunch, see the Pacific Coast Highway maybe. Yep. And. Uh, strategize for John and Martha tomorrow. My note says, Mr. Bullia, keep on smiling. It makes all the difference for us. We love serving happy customers. Thank you for flying with us this morning, Angela and Gabriel. What? Awesome. I think my note was better though. Yes, it was. Yeah, so yes, your note was better. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, our car rental wasn't available anymore, so we got this sweet upgrade for free. And of course, you cannot take a trip to California without checking out the Pacific Coast Highway, especially if you're driving a convertible. I know this might sound like a cliche, but it was definitely worth it. Hey guys, good morning. So um, we are here in San Diego. It's uh, eight o'clock in the morning, and we're very excited because today we are gonna meet the uh, the kings. Basically, I grew up just watching these guys' uh, videos, uh, especially when I was getting ready for my private and whatnot. And um, think about them like aviation royalty. Around 10 o'clock, we should be driving to um, their headquarters, and uh, we're gonna take a tour of their facilities and hopefully get to meet uh, John and Martha King. So stay tuned because it's gonna be it's gonna be fun. The U.S. Grand was a luxury to stay in. And I have to say, this is like a six to a seven star hotel instead of a five. Pretty excited, pretty excited. These, the Kings are absolutely legendary in aviation and what they've given to the cause of aviation safety and education is absolutely immeasurable. I have huge respect for them. I think we've begun to gain some stature and reputation as a flight training entity and to be able to meet with and be mentored by further this well-established entity, the Kings, is just a great opportunity. All right, I gotta be honest with you guys. At this point, 
we were all getting pretty nervous. I want to take this opportunity to give this amazing guy Chow a huge shout out. He and Farad made all this happen. Thank you. Okay, at this point, I think the kids were ready to meet us. Oh, 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 no way. Oh, 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 Thank you so much yeah. for taking the time. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Entrepreneurs, we'd like to give you a gift. Oh, come on. Seriously? And, uh, <laughs> and let's go. We, we, we want to sign it the way you want it signed. Oh, you go, thank guys. you. Guys, you can't imagine how nervous I was. I was literally trying to put the mic on John, and I was shaking so much. We had a friend who knew Bill Clinton. Okay. And he says, when you meet Bill Clinton, he'll grab you by the hand, pull your hand towards yeah, him. Yeah, that's right. And say, hi, how you doing? Good to see you. How long have you, how long have you been in aviation? <laughs> and, and, and he's talking about you all of a sudden. Right. And, and he's like your buddies. Yes. And that really, really works with people. I mean, yes, they, it does. They, 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 and it only yes. takes about, oh, uh, two minutes, and the person's yeah. happy. They're, they're, right. Right. they're happy. That's so we decided what we were going to do is do a Bill Clinton, uh, and we're not going to be president. But uh, but we decided what we would do we're is not done yet. <laughs> that's right, that's right. <laughs> Pull the people oh. towards us, yeah. look them in the eye, mm -hmm. and ask them about themselves. Yeah. There's fatigue, but the reward is fabulous because you hear so many wonderful oh, stories. Yeah, exactly. yeah. And some yeah. of them are you true. Uh, <laughs> 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 Even I, some of them. Yeah. Right. I, I mean, it. you you will have seen it in. Uh, and the students that come to you, the yeah. stories that they have of right. why they want to learn to fly, why they want uh, uh, to have a, a, a aviation career, or if not a career, just uh, why it calls to them so yes. strongly. Yep. Yes. yes, we try and do the equivalent on video. I mean, we, yeah, and you succeed. We, we, we try you and succeed. do that. Uh, and, uh, you do. Gosh uh, darn it. <laughs> <laughs> so my first two years wow, so look much. at that wow look at this. this is epic why did you have a dream to be a pilot it was a dream when i was a child because uh when i was home i uh back in the turkey uh, i used to spend the time with my grandmother and grandfather so much and we had a little balcony and the airport was really close to our home. Uh -huh. And that light... You're out on I, the balcony and could see airplanes. I was fell asleep uh, on, on my grandfather's lap, which is he passed oh. away. And then, uh, okay, this is the third one. There is no fifth one tonight. There is no fourth one tonight. Then sleeping. <laughs> then not coming. Oh, tonight just only two of them. These were big yeah. airlines? Exactly, mm. yeah. yeah. And then, then I say that I want to become a pilot and yeah. I want to do it at the right place, which is the United mm -hmm. States, because I, I was researching some uh, information about the FAA mm -hmm. and how the things goes. Mm -hmm. But it was hard until I found out of here. <laughs> okay, you know what? I think I'm going to change for this. I'll be right back. What do you guys think, huh? Oh, I love that. I, I have I mixed feelings that. about this. Okay, awesome. Oh, oh, oh and epic. That, and the line that should go with that is, we have your back. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. 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 Oh, large-ish. Small. Medium. See, one yeah. small, one large. One medium. I want to point out a term up here. I'm, I can't, I'm a teacher, so I got to teach. But this, we call it the unique selling proposition. You guys you know, know what a unique selling proposition is? I, I don't. It's what you do that your competitors don't do. It's you do wow. differently than everybody else. Okay. Wow. And, and so that's what's unique to us. It's our selling proposition. It's what we sell to our customers. So what we do is we take relatively complicated material, clarify it, simplify it, and make it fun. Yes. 
So when we go into the studio, one of the things we remind everybody, we're supposed to make this clear, simple, and fun. If the script is, isn't easy to understand, we need to fix it. And if it isn't fun, we need to fix it. So that's what we do, and, that's, and that reminds of us, tells ourselves what our unique selling proposition is. And this happened. Hi, I'm Paul with your weekend weather. Let's start by taking a look at some temperatures around the nation. Looks like 60s and 70s east of the Rockies. Kansas City at a balmy 72. Wichita looking at a comfortable 70. <laughs> Great day for flying. Now, now turn back towards the camera. Look with your right hand. Yep. Okay. Now look at the temperatures. Okay. Temperature 74. Wind calm. Visibility 10 miles. Uh, Relative humidity. <laughs> blood pressure. <laughs> 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 no, your blood pressure is higher than that. <laughs> I hope so. Oh, okay. So now kind of turn around behind you and enjoy a great day and fun flying in America's finest city. Okay. Enjoy a great day and fun flying in America's finest city. That's a good hey. There we go. That's a good I'm interested in, uh, what is the highest number of courses that it's been so far that you guys sell for? Um, we think a couple million. It's, it sounds bragging, uh, and, and we don't really mention that number a lot because it's a big number. Yeah. Uh, but over the years, uh, you know, uh, there's only about a million pilots in, in the United States, and only about 600,000. So how can you have a couple million uh, courses or customers? <laughs> and, well, but, but the people also yeah. turn over. Some people yeah, get older right. and die, right. and new people come along. And yeah. So that's it's a, right. a big moving group of people. That's right. Are we ready to go to the... Uh, whenever you're ready. Where are we going, guys? We're going to go to uh, a, 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 a restaurant on the airport. Really? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Wow. That's yeah. awesome. Yes. Yeah. Uh, our airplane... I don't see it here. It was ready for takeoff, right? We were supposed, right. supposed to be the first airplane to take off. So somebody else did, though. <laughs> the Kings took us to a Mexican restaurant. How crazy is that? The steak taquitos were pretty much out of this world. To be honest with you guys, I was seriously expecting this whole encounter to last, I don't know, maybe 30 minutes to an hour. But no, we actually spent the whole day with them and clearly we were not the only fans but we never felt like one of them we felt like fellow entrepreneurs sharing stories they were definitely curious about how we started out of here our background and that to me is speaks volumes we really have a great grasp on the most important thing and that is you make people's dreams come true keep on doing it I cannot express enough my gratitude for our general manager, Farad, and the whole King School team for making this happen for us. To have the validation of such high caliber people like John and Martha King is a feeling that I cannot describe. When I speak about this experience, I'm speaking for Paul, Farad, and myself. This marks a before and after for Avir as an entity in aviation. We cannot wait for all the opportunities that with hard work, will come our way. And we hope that you guys can join us. Until next time.